Hi guys, so I'm the only one in the theater right now, but I'm seeing Titanic, and I've never seen it before, and this is the first time I'm seeing it in theaters and 3D. And I've never seen a 3D movie either, so I'm literally the only one in charge in 18 minutes to come. You Kevin Bacon? But I'm also seeing it all by myself. So this should be good. I'll let you guys know how it is. I got a popcorn and a slush. So what if I'm the only one here? Because who sees a movie at 12.30? But this is the only showing I can make. Because it was either this, 5 p.m., 9.30, and it's a three and a half hour movie. So if I saw it at 9.30, It'd be over at 1 in the morning. I'm seeing it at 12.30 because I can't make the 5 p.m. one. Like, that's a good time, but I couldn't make it. I hope I'm the only one in the theater. Like, that'd be so nice. My sister was the only one in the theater for the One Direction movie, so you probably can't hear anything I'm saying. Okay, so I never really talked about what I thought about Titanic, but it was so good. We laughed, we cried. We being me, singular. I'm not gonna spoil it, even though it came out like forever ago and you probably should have seen it by now. I 10 out of 10 recommend it, especially since I'm like the one for those movies. Like that sad, sappy stuff, like that's my, that's my jam. Like that's all I watch. Like Five Feet Apart is one of my favorite movies. I've seen it probably 25 times. I should have seen the Titanic because that is right up my alley and it was just so phenomenal also there was nothing to spoil what was i talking about like you already know like it was very well produced i think the shots of like the married couple in bed and like while it was sinking just like waiting the woman like putting her children to sleep like while it was sinking i don't know i just really liked how it was put together and like i don't know i really liked it i really enjoyed it so if you haven't seen it go watch it right now that's all pretty outside usually there's a good sunset but not today school is almost over i'm so excited because this summer is gonna be so fun i'm just so ready for it oh my gosh camp camp i'm so excited also you see that ucsb right there that's my dream college in case you don't know i've been wanting to go to ucsb since like forever like after i saw ucla's acceptance rate like oh anyways yeah i've just been looking at my teacher's assignments for the new year setting up my notion and just planning all my stuff out because i have so much going on this summer that i just want to have it all laid out 
ready to go. I used the Emma Chamberlain planner and I'm gonna need a new one because I'm almost out. It runs out in June, so I can't really plan. I also have this camera and it's like my favorite camera ever. It takes like the coolest photos. The battery compartment broke. Like it, it was cracked and then it just broke. So now the battery compartment doesn't close. I'm trying to order a replacement part, but nobody sells one for the camera that I have. I might just have to get a new one, which is, they're only like $10. I got the battery compartment. Should I tilt this down? So do you see my room? I'm gonna redo my room. You see Harry Styles right behind me? I love, I've loved Harry Styles since I was like five. I still love him, but I don't know if I want a shine on my wall. I used to be like, yes, but now I'm kind of like, no. That's funny because like in the first week of this year, I have a teacher who was like making a joke about how I probably have like posters of Harry Styles on my wall. I was like, huh, no. So. <laughs> funny. That's, that's besides the point. I got all my stuff. So fourth quarter <laughs> is gonna be bad. Third quarter for me was honestly a breeze. It was super easy. Everyone acts like it's the hardest one, but not for me. So the first day that I get back, I have to take my AP Psych. So I have my day planner. I talked about this in another video, but I'll go through it again. I got it from Amazon. I could link it down below if you're interested. What you must get done today, your to-do list, schedule, another to-do list, water, and your mood. It's like two pockets. Like it has one that's like that and like this. So here's my Emma Chamberlain planner and she's falling apart. I'm actually on spring break right now. I haven't been to the beach at all because it's been cold. New Smyrna is just chaos. I did see Train though. It was very fun. I had a wonderful time and they sounded exactly like the recordings. I also need to buy a new photo album. I put all my film photos in a, uh, I put them all in a photo album and I have these ones from Hawaii but I don't have a photo album. I'm going on a cruise. Get back from the cruise the day that I go to camp. You can understand why that would be a little bit stressful. Why is my hair greasy? You can understand why that would be a little bit stressful but I'm very nervous because I might have to come a day late or like pick another week but all my friends are going that week I'm just so excited and nervous on um, how that will play out there's no point in stressing about something that you cannot change wise words for your Friday Sunday when do I post I don't even know and I have my camp binder because camp is soon and I just want to have like a binder with like everything in it there are so many cheers like so many cheers that we do a flagpole and I just want everyone to be able to know them like if anybody asks the words I want to have them all here so I have a, a list of all the cheers I need to print out the lyrics I'm also gonna have like a page with like playlists of like songs for breakfast or like pre-game hype like showers you know like all that good stuff and have like the Spotify codes so you can scan them my application in here too bracelet pattern descriptions of the games we play in the afternoon so if like one of the girls asks me what we're playing and like how to play I can just show her I have Vesper ideas which is basically at night we like have a little talk we sometimes get deep sometimes it's fun and then i'll also have my packing list in here i'm going to be doing a camp packing video in case you're interested that will be coming soon like i've said like three times like this summer is going to be wonderful i'm gonna be posting some good stuff this summer um anyways i think that's all for this week's video i hope you enjoyed i know this was kind of like a boring one but sorry like i don't know what to tell you but yeah i'll see you guys next week bye If you've never heard Jeff Buckley, like, I 10 out of 10 recommend. Like, there's nobody better. I mean, like, him and Coldplay, my my two favorites. Ooh, I'm done. I'm done. It's your birthday. We got a record, not the kind you purchase. I'm a mind with the way you work it.